Saint Margaret of Scotland, also known as Margaret of Wessex, was the second wife of Malcolm III, the Queen of Scotland and English princess. Along with her family, Margaret had been exiled, when King Canute and his Viking army had stormed the England. She returned to England in 1057. Margaret was the daughter of the English Prince Edward the Exile and his wife Agatha, and granddaughter of Edmund Ironside. She was born in Hungary, along with her brother Edgar the Etherling. Margaret and her family returned to England, when her father Edward Etherling was recalled as a possible successor, to her uncle Edward the Confessor. The English nobility elected military experience Harold Godwinson as Edward's successor, because Edgar was considered too young. After Harold's defeat at the Battle of Hastings, Edgar was proclaimed King of England, but when the Normans advanced to London, Edgar, Margaret, Christina and their mother Agatha fled to Northumbria. Margaret and her family's position was fearing for their lives, they fled northwards, in the opposite direction to the advancing Normans, then their ships was blown off course to the Kingdom of Scotland. The Normans proved impossible, and William secured his new throne by defeating rebellions in various parts, and became the King of England. There they were given protection by King Malcolm III, the Scottish King. The location where it is believed that they landed, is known today as St. Margaret's Hope. Malcolm was protective towards Margaret, she refused his proposal of marriage, because of her intention to become a nun. Margaret's sister Christina did become a nun, but Margaret married Malcolm in 1070. Their union was exceptionally happy, for both themselves and the Scottish Kingdom. In 1070, Malcolm devastated Yorkshire. William the Conqueror eventually put an end to the raids, with a combined land and sea campaigns. A peace finally broke out before a battle about to begun, and also Malcolm sweared allegiance to William as the superior monarch, as the terms of agreement, providing Duncan his son as a hostage. Margaret was very pious Christian and done many charitable works. She founded churches, monasteries and pilgrimage hostels, and established the royal mausoleum with monks. Malcolm was killed during a campaign in Northumberland, during the Battle of Annick. Margaret's son Edward died in the same incident. Queen Margaret was already weak from a period of fasting, but after hearing the deaths of her husband, she passed away in 1093. Margaret's children went into exile in England, as a retaliation began against English influence in Scotland. Malcolm's younger sibling became monarch of Scotland, Donald III. Margaret's children reclaimed their inheritance, with the help of William II of England, as the first Sir Edgar became the King of Scotland. Two more sons, Alexander I of Scotland and David I of Scotland, became the monarchs of Scotland. The royal houses of England and Scotland became closer allies. Margaret was made a saint by church, in recognition of spreading Roman Catholicism, and her work for poor in Scotland. She is today better known as Saint Margaret of Scotland, or sometimes called Pearl of Scotland. Various churches around the world are dedicated in honor of Saint Margaret. One of the oldest is, Saint Margaret's Chapel in Edinburgh Castle in Edinburgh.